Aloha, one and all. We are back for XCOM. Uh, actually, I want to show you something. This is kind of funny. I just noticed this. There's like a Muton Elite or some shit inside this thing here. Hey, Bob, are we going to go interrogate him? I don't know. Um, it's kind of actually kind of neat. I can kind of just take a look around because this is actually like this is the. I think that's the. The hyperwave relay. This is the um, uh, the gallop chamber right here. It's kind of neat. Just to, I, I like this attention to detail. It's really cool. Uh, this is my workshops. Weird formation of workshops. Um, and that's the thermal generator that you saw before. Uh, that's the that's the side labs right here. So you know the people who are doing their side testing. They're almost done that too. Uh, these are more workshops that I put down. It's kind of cool. And here's like the the satellite relays I had. Neat shit, you know. Anyways, okay. Uh, and we got like our rooms here, and uh, I don't even know what this is. But uh, anyways, interesting stuff. I like this. It's fun. Uh, oh, look, the dude. It's like the dinner place, and also two guys jogging. <laughs> You know, I have a lot of women on the team. I don't know where they are right now, actually. I think this game's being kind of sexist here. Oh no, there's a bald, bald girl right here. The, the first woman we see in our base. Is this is this my place? Oh, I think this is my area. Neat. This is where this is where I work. It's kind of just cool shit. Uh, I don't even know what this stuff does. Oh, this is locker rooms before uh, XCOM gets sent out. I guess. And then this is the whatever room. Oh, and here we have some weapons, but unfortunately it's still all the old crap weapons. Not the new laser plasma weapons, no siree. And this is where the Sky Ranger gets launched. And this is where engineering is, and uh, I don't even know where the, oh, the good doctor is right over here. Okay, that's pretty much it. That's kind of fun to see, you know. That much attention to detail, you can't hate it. Alright, so we got, um, alright, this one, this massive fucking mission. Oh yeah, I'm looking forward to this one. Uh, I'm debating actually putting something else on these guys. Because maybe they don't need alien grenades. Whatever, we'll keep it on them anyways. I was thinking about giving them, like, uh, ch chitin armor so they get a bit more HP. Oh, yes, yeah, so one of the things I'm definitely doing today is it stop this. My power levels. So that, that's the Archangel armor. I, I guess I never did show that off. But we're actually we're putting on Titan armor on everybody today. Uh, except for, obviously, the, the people who use ghost armor, which are, uh, these two guys. So, you know, the Archangel armor kind of cool, I guess, if you want to fly around and stuff. I don't get any benefits when my snipers use it, so there's really no point in it, for me at least, so, uh, we're not using it. What may be XCOM's last mission of extreme difficulty, of extremeness. We have visual on the mission site. Setting down. France is sending an urgent mission request. Well, France is dumb. Looks like the aliens went down in a sparsely populated area. If there are civilians in the area, I hope they stay clear. He says that every time. You know they never do. They're, they're civvies. What the hell? We, we are literally on the UFO. Well, it is a giant battleship mission. Hey, look, the, the Sky Ranger's right here. Oh, I guess this is how we do our little entry, huh? Alright. Uh, actually, this is something interesting I learned. Um, apparently, the order of which you have people in your squad matters, so... The fact that these two are in the middle are, means they're always at the front. It's some, something kind of interesting I learned recently. Uh, let's get the heavies in there. Because they have very low radius of movement. And one more guy. Actually, Mr. Shiv should be going beside them. Yeah, let's just end the turn. Alright, guys. This is what we train for. 
or not. I'm hearing people. The hell could we possibly be hearing? Whatever. Okay, this is what we trade for. Breach the door, breach the door! And it's sad. Oh wait. Oh yeah, there's something there. It's okay. Just occurred to me that there was like a what the hell is this even? Why is this ship why is this ship on fire? So I could EMP them, you know, just to like make it less challenging for myself, but that's where's the fun in that? You know? Well no no, sorry, not EMP. Uh use something but the EMP. EMP leaves the most supplies but also the most enemies, so I, I could use like the fusion cannon or something. Probably should look into that. God damn it, stop moving around, you jerks. Oh god, contact! Oh no. Nobody's here. Alright, uh, guess we're just gonna head right out here. Oh fuck! The cyber desk! Oh god! Please, please leave me alone. Okay. So, here's where we stand. I'm in a terrible fucking place. He's totally gonna die if he stays here. So, like, I have a couple of options. I can, I can start moving people out to basically shoot them, or I can move him back in. And I moved him as far as he can go, so he can only do one more thing. Um... I need to make a call on these things. Because here's the other problem we have. These guys will be more than happy to throw grenades if I clump them up. I can't really get them in very well. Um, will he be able to kind of go into here if I... Uh, yeah, we're, no, we're, we're, we're not going to do this. I think this is a much better idea. So just basically... Uh, I'm going to toss a grenade in here as well. It, it was a bad situation to begin with. Yeah, I don't think I can move them any farther than this. Because I want to have these snipers on overwatch. They'll, they'll take shots. Okay. Uh, yeah, I know they're all together. But hopefully they won't realize... What? Oh, we can actually aim for this bot. We just kill him. And... The one that actually had the uh, smoke grenade that I wanted is uh, now dead, but uh, now used his turn. But we'll just uh, we'll just use this one here. That's okay. And if we see the other guy from my other position, then we will we'll be okay. Uh, let's see, suppress. Yeah, we're gonna suppress that cyber disc. And everyone else will overwatch. Because hopefully he doesn't actually know I have anybody there. And that is, that is what I'm kind of sticking with right now. Are you kind of mad at something? What's he doing? Okay. Well, now we can kind of open fire on him. If you call that opening fire. Oh, he's got 70%. You know, it might as well be just be 0%, you know? Okay, now I have an option. I can either suppress or fire again. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use my suppression on my second turn. Because we have done literally no damage. And everyone else overwatches just in case those... I, I'm looking around for those floaters. I'm hoping they get into my sniper sights. And what's, what's his plan now? He's uh, pretty suppressed, I'd say. Alright. Sniper's gonna have to move up here. Uh, well, I can use Psy Inspiration. Guys, you feel inspired yet? I mean, she needs to level up Psy anyways. Okay, every, everyone's, feel, everyone's feeling really good. Uh, <laughs> that's pretty much all it does. Alright, we can go use one more. Possibly can fire a grenade in. You know, if I, if I get sick of doing whatever, then I can do that. But what, what what's my other guy's chance to hit? 45? you got to be kidding me. Oh, you know, let's do it. There's no point. You know, I, I'm just... I, I think they'll hit them. I think they'll hit him by accident one day. What? Oh, what? Six damage. Oh, right, because he has that, that tech bonus. Yeah, no. Uh, great shooting there. Oh, you can just go reload. This 
kind of hoping that those uh, floaters would kind of come in. So what's what's his plan now? Okay, he's just gonna stand there the whole time. You know, not that I'm complaining. Cause I mean that works for me. Gives my uh, sniper the opening she needs. Come on, let's get some levels today, okay? This is not how we start out this fucking video. Oh boy. Oh, we got a 50% here. Holy shit, we actually hit it. That's insane. Alright. Uh, well, I think we're just gonna move him over here and reload. Uh, I think we're pretty much good with everybody else. Wait, okay, now they come out? Yeah, I was, I was kind of wondering what they were up to. Uh, we seem to have hit the wall a little bit. You know, your UFO kind of needs some redecorating. And they're gonna throw a grenade. No, no, they're retarded and won't do that. That actually surprised the hell out of me. Now I need to spread everybody out. Alright. Uh, question is, can my sniper actually get a shot off? Excellent, you can. To 10 damage. I would like someone to start it off. Uh, they do up to 10, I got 5-5, five, five. okay. There's no way you can kill him. Unless it's a critical. Which is a very high chance of that, fine, we'll try it anyways. Now you're just gonna miss every single shot today, aren't you? Fuck it. Yeah, 95% chance of critical, I don't know why I didn't lead with this. That would be why. Oh, man. Uh, okay. I'm gonna start moving some people back. Uh, I can suppress somebody. Oh, good. The, the door actually counts as cover. That's nice. Okay, well, let's suppress that guy. He says something really mean to me. Uh, and I guess we could just overwatch? Who else has a turn? He does. I, don't want, I, I want to kind of leave that guy for uh, my sniper to kill. Oh, whatever. Fine, overwatch. Oh, Volkov can shoot. I guess he might as well overwatch too. And hopefully they'll just take pot shots at him. They, they shouldn't see... Yeah, but whatever. We'll see. Oh, she hit my he hit my sniper. Now if he moves, he'll trigger my Overwatch. And ooh, what the hell was he shooting at that time? No one really knows. All right, well let's let's just finish him off. Mr. Colin really needs his upgrades today. Uh, I guess we're just gonna go and... Well, we got a 50% on him. He is be he's behind full cover somehow. Which I find to be kind of odd, because, uh... Because that, that means full, does it not? Whatever, your aim is terrible. That's all I have to say. Uh, what else do we have as an opening? Uh, well, we can... You, here's what we're gonna do. We can start it off with, like, a grenade. To ruin the cover that he's behind, potentially, but I probably want to keep that, but now nah. I've got rockets. This guy has a ton of rockets. Okay, now he has no more cover. That's a really big gun he has. And that takes care of him. Alright, well, everyone gets a reload today. Oh yeah, I guess I guess we should heal uh, this guy right here, Mr. Shiv. Do what you were made for, repairing. All right, good stuff. Let's start bringing people out. All right, Zhang, go check it again. Tell me if uh, you see anything. Okay, no, nothing there. Uh, and we're gonna get also. Uh, where's my other sniper? Yeah. Come right over here. 
Oh, fuck. It is unlikely they would be in that area. Yet they were there. <laughs> well, uh, I think these are the Muton Elites. Yep, so I want to capture one of these ones anyway. So let's just kill one. Probably actually could have cloaked to get a crit, but that's only really worth it. Okay, I have a suppression I can lay down on both of them. Um, smoke grenade would also be helpful here. She doesn't have uh, Mr. Mr. Colin doesn't actually have the upgrade, which actually allows him to. And the only person with a smoke grenade uh, happens to be the one that uh, can't use it. Oh boy. Um, okay, we're going to have to accept the fact right now that they can get a shot. Um, I'm on high ground right now, so I think I won't have a problem with. Uh, that's great cover you have there. Okay. Just suppress them. Keep them. Hopefully. What the hell? You're just shooting. You're shooting Volkov in the back. Volkov doesn't care though. If they come up here, my two guys will overwatch. Really piss poor idea on my part. And they're gonna, he's going to shoot at him, luckily, which is really good for me, actually. My sniper is actually the weaker one. But, you know, he's got great def He's got, he's got, well, he got a little bit lucky, but he's got, he's got enough health to, to last through that, so. Okay, we have an option here to mine fray, potentially, which is, like, up to, like, five damage. Or we can just snipe his ass. 64. I'll take it. Okay. The other one is the one we're going to capture. Uh, which means we got to go behind here. We gotta, we gotta get some shots off on him. 45 is not very good odds, to be honest. Uh, although Volkov has really good odds. Okay, we want to make this a crit. So. so this is what we do. We ghost for a turn. Now we shoot him. And that's it. That's, that's, the, that's what we want to do. And now we suppress again. He's not the one who actually does damage whenever he suppresses. Uh, okay, and here's the plan. We're gonna move him. I was sticking against this wall, but he could just kind of turn the corner. Yeah, you know, it's against the wall. Both of them ready to go. And if I overwatch, they sh he shouldn't move, but that's... I don't know. Hopefully he won't go anywhere. Hopefully he'll just get a little mad. Okay, good, 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 good. I love it when they're a little bit mad. All right, let's let's go introduce ourselves. Why, hello there. Meet Mr. Stun Gun. I love you, Triple Strike. You're you're a great fella. Let me just tell you that right now. So now we got our Muton Elite that I missed was missing actually last time. You know, there's like three types of like Mutons. Like that's that's why I miss it. Okay, I'll be honest with you. Okay, now let's not make any more retarded mistakes where we move people up too far. As I say, as I probably did the exact same thing. Really enough, I'm hearing the music still, which means there's still someone active. No, it's, it's, you know, it surprises me as much as you guys that my people don't get killed more often. Uh, okay. Well, we're good on that end. Uh, we're actually, no, this is the boundary too. Where are we actually trying to go? Wow. Wow. Okay, I guess that's where we're going. We're going down this way. Oh boy. Alright, we're not going to try going too far. Uh, snipers will be watching and waiting. Uh, and my heavies will uh, cover up the rear. And someone's stomach is growling in that direction. That's that's rather specific, especially considering the fact that uh, we kind of know they were in the other direction. Uh, well, there's like there's not many places they could be. Well, the easiest thing is just to kind of come back right back up here. Uh, all right. Well, let's just dash everyone back. 
We're turning back, guys. Do a 180. Or a 420. Because it's, it's XSX Snipes 420. It's, that's uh, turned around enough. Alright, we gotta go flush out the guy that's like right over there. And it's not gonna be pretty. Someone might die. Or get shot up a little bit. Pick one. Uh, okay. We got... Uh, Mr. Shiv. It's gonna come down to here. And this guy will just kind of go down here. Okay, that's the farthest I'm moving. And the last guy is this one. Because we already know everything else is safe, so we're okay. Yeah, they certainly are over there. It's good just to have to be like a door breach or whatever the hell we do. What? Oh god. Take a shot, take a shot, take a shot! Good man! Another, um, he got an upgrade too. Yeah. These are the promotions we want to see our team getting. Okay, so they, they have been alerted to our presence. We unfortunately can't actually get a sight on them. Um, so our first priority is actually moving somebody up here to see where the hell they are. Really, that's all you're doing? Fortunately, nobody else has a shot. But it should be actually a relatively easy kill, to be honest. I'm actually not concerned, because everybody can shoot him at this point. I oh, know, he's intimidating. What are you gonna do? There's an entire ramp between us. Oh god, he's running towards us. Oh, well. Yeah, it should still make things really easy, all the same. I mean, he's gonna have to come through that door. When he does, he's just gonna get boned. Or something. I don't know what he's gonna do. Hey, what's up? Oh, man. This is gonna be a good. <laughs> uh, they left Volkov with blue balls. Sorry, Volkov. Hey, everyone. Pulse Commentary Mike here. And uh, this one's gonna be a doozy because this entire episode was about an hour and I have no idea how I trimmed it down, but yeah, it was, it was really bad. So you may get some more DuckTales or some shit later. Um, I don't know what I... What I but th this time I decided actually to tell you what I was going to do. So at this point I decided to move all my snipers up because I had this really cool idea. You know, if you bring along ghost armor, you might as well use um, one of its best abilities, which is that, uh, that grapple hook thing. This is like the one place where I thought, like, you know, oh good, it's useful. Because you can't get up there any other way besides the grapple hook. And I, I guess, I guess, really, I just wanted to use it, so I figured I'd uh, cloak them, and uh, we didn't see anything, so it's okay. I really like how fast the the sound goes. But uh, you know, as you can tell, I'm probably being really overly cautious here. But you know, in most cases, I'm actually not overly cautious. Uh, I probably don't do enough, and I don't plan ahead enough um, for the worst case scenario. Like a lot of other people who do this on impossible, they're like. They plan, they do, every mission takes an hour because they don't want to lose a single person because every, everybody really counts. And I try and do things a little bit faster because I don't want to be here forever, but uh, you know, sometimes, like, as I said, this mission took an hour and it's, it's ridiculous, so it's difficult, it is difficult. Uh, you know, so far you haven't seen anything yet, uh, but you know, it's, it's uh, good stuff. So uh, first door, uh, nothing there. It's just a very, it's kind of like a straightaway with two uh, sides to it, so they're, you know, I, I guess that they're all at the end at this point. But we're hearing them come from, like, the right, so I was just assuming they were just beyond the door or on the other side. Because uh, we've actually done this map sev on several occasions, uh, and I hadn't seen them at this point either, uh, and that was what my, my plan, so let's get back. Oh, fuck! Really? They, okay, they patrolled into my little, uh, formation here. Um, I kind of wasn't expecting that. Work. Who can see them? You guys can. What? There's a giant building in the way of everybody else. Well, I'm almost inclined to say fuck everything and, and fire a giant rocket there. So let's do that. I didn't realize there was a giant thing in the way here. Well, that solves that. 
Uh, let's see. We can shoot him for 60%. That's like the that's like a crack. Look at this thing. The worst line of sight ever. All right. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna assume he's just dead at this point because I have an extra rocket. Um, let's see if we can save some, save that rocket with some uh, shots from my fellow squad members. Okay. Uh, can you shoot him? No, you can't. My snipers happen to be extremely accurate, so you know, come on over. If anyone can get it done, it's Volkov. Oh, you know, you should be able to do it. You know, trick shots are his middle name, so. Well, let's just overwatch just to make sure it's all okay. That's why, you know, it's Gunslinger, man. You know, I, I didn't believe it myself, but fuck, it does come in handy. Okay, it just sounds like there's a, a creepy ethereal or whatever. Because that's, that's the ethereal noise, I think. Alright, uh, well, open it up. Let's see, crack it open, let's see what's inside. Oh shit! It's a. Uh, well, it's not really that at all. Alright, can Volkov get a shot? Yes, he can. Excellent, man. A shot of what is the question? On a stupid ass thing. Okay. That's a fucking waste of my time. Thanks. Um. Uh, so as of this moment, I am inclined to actually pull back because we don't actually have a worthwhile shot on anything, but we can at least take out that guy. There's nothing worth really shooting at here. I'm just hoping that he'll kind of come, come closer to me. Who else has a shot? You are the guy with the plasma rifle. That's no good. Uh, oh, I probably shouldn't have moved that guy all the way there. Okay, let's do it like this. Wait, wait he's got a shot? Wait, who can see him? Oh, that was a mistake. I didn't realize there's a little hole there that you can see. Oh well, it's five damage. Oh fuck, fuck, Mister Shiv, come on, get your head in the game, bro. All right. There's, I, I thought there was no angle here, but apparently there was. So, all right. Well, uh, we can't actually see him anymore. What? Since when do we activate these guys? My snipers can't shoot any of them. Yeah, we know where they are. We, we literally just saw them. I, I know you can hear them, dude. Alright, um... We're gonna pull back. We are falling back. We're gonna let them come to us, because I'm just not... I'm not playing games today uh, with these guys. It's th These are really quite terrible positions. Oh, great stuff. We got- they got a shot off over there. And... is that Cyberdust coming? To us? You know, I'm- I'm- I'm almost in- what the fuck? Hi! Don't kill Mr. Shiv, please. Holy shit, he got critical too. Dude, he just took that like a boss. He just took it to the face. He's like, oh, what? Now, now he's awake. Now he's done panicking. Alright. Oh, we got both of these guys. Uh, I don't, how much health does Mr. Shiv have? Oh, he's got one HP. That's fabulous. Um, we can shoot... Oh, that? Come on, you can do that. I, you know, I probably should let him shoot, though. Well, sector, whatever. Okay, you missed it. Alright, well, um, first things first, we need to move him to full cover right here. So he can go heal himself and just kind of suck his thumb in the corner here. That's a lot of HP he lost. I mean, he almost died. 
Alright, well, you know, we are behind shit cover. Um, so we're gonna head back, actually, with him, too. Okay, we don't see anybody, so let's just, uh, overwatch. Wait for them. And he triggered nobody's overwatch. And this guy's just gonna stand here and take the bullets. Okay. How do they know how far my overwatch is? I call bullshit. Whatever. Alright, and you can suppress him just in case. Which I think he takes... Ah, uh, no, he doesn't take damage. Well, we might as well just move up here. Good stuff. You know, I guess he, I guess my medics might as well heal each, like themselves. Uh, well, actually, this one can just... Well, actually, no, everyone needs a bit of healing. I, I want to kind of reduce the amount of med bay time we're uh, taking in. The, the only problem is we have another ethereal that we still have to... Fuck, they never get triggered by overwatch. Hi. Hello. Fuck, I just healed him. You're a piece of shit. That's not very gentlemanly of you. Okay, yeah, it's it's time for fucking my sniper here to get the shot. Actually, wait, can I just mine frame? Ah, uh, that works. Side side stuff. You know, we haven't used that in like just now. Uh, actually, Mr. Shift kind of needs heals, so let's go. Get, let's go over there and prepare to heal him. Even though everyone's taking a bit of damage today. I, I want to keep two revives just in case that I need to bring someone back. Because you really don't know the situation that I'm going to be in in a little bit. What, how can we not heal him? Uh, I guess he's not close enough. Well, the, uh, while our mags are kind of just introducing themselves to there. Uh, okay, there. Good stuff. I'm just gonna make sure, you know, you all want Mr. Shift to live, let's be honest. And we'll just end it. Actually, everyone can use a little bit of a reload, so we'll do that actually in a minute. I know the guy's over there, but I not gonna really do that much damage. Even if he does kind of poke his head out. Alright, we're ready then. Oh, what? Mutons now, too. I kind of wasn't expecting that, I won't lie. Well, we can shoot one of them. I mean, worst case scenario right now, we just we kind of just move back. And he's, he's not too happy. Volkov panicked, so I can't use my double tap. No, don't kill him. Thank you. Good job. Excellent. You shot that thing. Now, now we have less valuable. Oh my god. Fucking Mr. Shiv. What, what's going on? No! What the fuck? You fucking asswipe. This is why we need to replace people with high, higher willed, like, players. This is exactly what I need on the fucking final boss. Is everyone shooting each other. There's no excuse for that, Mr. Shiv. You're fucking off the team. God damn it. I don't care how bad your bloodlust was. We don't go shooting teammates. Alright. I'm gonna prevent him from moving up with Overwatch. Because I don't want him to actually leave that area. Okay, good. He just stays there. Actually, he probably should have left so that Volkov could have got a shot. Probably could have found a better angle to shoot this guy from. Okay, he's he's unfortunately gonna get flanked by the little machine thing, but that's okay. Uh, I don't really like these odds, but you know we we played them anyways. Okay, so the plan right now is to possibly move him into a better sniper position. 
and her into a better sniper position as well. And Mr. Shiv, just go like fucking suck your thumb or something. I don't know. Go over here. I mean, right as of right now, like it's pretty much done. Okay, so suppress him. And we'll just and well, actually, I can I can just uh, bring out my pistol and we'll watch. He's like shooting him every time. Suppression is the worst ability. Oh, grenade, of course. Things are really going to hell fast. I had nothing to do with this. Yeah, we know the cyber disc is destroyed. We don't like cyber discs. Uh, we can't headshot, but we can just shoot him. It's not a kill, though. It's up to nine damage. I rolled on this, this slightly the low scale. I don't want to heal right now. Uh, as much as... Uh, fucking XX snipes. You, he's so gonna die if I don't heal him. Alright, Mr. Shiv. Use your med pack on him. And we're gonna just keep the last one around. I wasted on on the other guy before. I should have done that. We got we got at least an ethereal out there. I mean, there was like 23 enemies. I think we knew this was gonna be tough, but this tough couldn't have, couldn't have expected it. There's no possible way this can go wrong. Okay, everyone, all crouched, hunched together. Let's do this. And fucking hell! Oh Christ! Rockets away! All right, so we got a couple of. Rockets we can fire here. Hopefully I'll get most of them. If not, then I guess we'll see. Yeah, it's we're gonna kill these two, I guess, first. And the last rocket right here. Uh, we could just we could kinda just do this. Let's 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 line this up, shall we? Let's let's make this work the first time. Uh, that's a weird thing. I can't actually go scroll up any more than this. So, like, I, I thought I was hitting him, but I guess I'm not. Hopefully I'll get them both. If not, then I'll be really mad. Yeah, no, that didn't, that, that, that didn't work. Okay. Doesn't matter, because there's only one guy there. I, I wasn't dealing with the ethereal today, I'm sorry. Alright. Let's see, what kind of shot do we have? Not a very good one. Uh, do you have a good shot? No. I think I do have a mind fray I can pull off. Yes, I do. Um, I could go here and kind of like... Wait, who's this person? Doesn't have a lot of health. Mr. Shiv has a lot of health. However, this guy's kind of blocking the way. Uh, what is my opportunity for? Okay, that's dashing, and this is not dashing. Okay, I'm pretty much sure I'm gonna get flanked. Uh, 
Okay, there was cover here, but I kind of wrecked it. Like, I mean, Volkov can just, um... I, I, like, I, I'm, try I'm trying to get... Oh, wait, wait, I can go up here. That's a good idea. I didn't see this alternate path here, and that means I get a flank shot. Not a very good one, but it's one I'll take nonetheless. Alright, we got one over there and one over there. Both of them not very good shots. Mr. Shiv can go up here. It will not be a flank shot. If I go here, it will be a flank shot. My chance to hit should be rather big, or I could just smoke grenade. And I'm actually almost inclined to say we're going to do a smoke grenade. One percent? Oh, because he's now in the fucking smoke grenade thing. I didn't think about that. Oh well. Mind Frey doesn't have any, uh, limit. Okay. Now we're gonna overwatch, hopefully just so he doesn't do anything. Wait, where the hell did those guys come from? Alright, yeah. We got an overwatch there. These are just normal floaters, too. Uh, let's see. 69. Oh, it's the same amount. I got much higher on those ones, but I kind of want to get the 69 in. Mine, that's your favorite number, Triple Strike. I know you. Okay, that didn't work out. 29. Yeah, this is not good. Alright. I got a plan now. Uh, let's see, we got two on these. I, I should have done this to start to start with, but I should have just brought him up here with clo with Ghost. Cloak him, bring him up here. This is a really not a good position we're in right now, to be honest. But I, I can't, I can't just, I can't stay here. I can't continue to do this. Alright, Mr. Shiv, uh, you, you're a gentleman and a scholar. I say we just suppress them both, because that's like, that's like Overwatch. And Mr. Shiv will just, oh fuck. Oh right, he was Overwatching, I forgot. Uh, and Mr. Shiv got hit. Uh, walk it off, sir. You can deal with it. We got 70 on that guy, 70. Okay. We're gonna fire at the floater, and that's for reasons that I'm trying to limit them, because I'm gonna su suppress the other two this turn. Yeah, okay. Suppress him. Okay, and then now we suppress the other one. Oh, cool. He took a bit of damage. Okay, we're basically, we basically set up for our snipers this turn. He can go shoot Mr. Shiv, that's fine. Mr. Shiv will just, he'll walk that off. <laughs> he still returns fire. Alright, what's he gonna do? Oh, God. Oh, oh. See ya, Mr. Shiv. He's critically wounded, though. He's gonna be okay. Okay, snipers revealed, snipers out of cover. Okay, that's a really piss poor place for my sniper to be. Um, 73, but it should work. Okay, that's one. Uh, I got a 95 on that and a 45 on that. Alright, so let's just kill this one. And now we just have this guy to deal with. I have already tried to ruin his cover, I'm pretty sure. It didn't work the last time. Uh, the other problem we have right now is that I can't actually move my guys up to attack him. Uh, I can eat, I have two options. I can dash someone up there to try and get a flank. But I'm, I don't have a whole lot of great options here. Um, Mr. Shiv will be okay for... Oh wait, no he's not. 
Not from a guy that only has 3 HP. Alright. No, we're moving him back. That was a piss poor idea. Okay. Who has more HP? He does. Okay. I'm inclined to dash him up here, so next turn he can he has the option of a flank. Mr. Shiv. Uh, no, no. Uh, Volkov will try and get a headshot right now. Uh, it's a very low probability. Wasn't expecting that to work, to be honest. And they, he will suppress. Messing up his aim and hopefully making it easier for my guys to kind of move in. Because we need to kill this guy with his thumb now. That's why I've moved up the guy with slightly more HP. Alright, um... So here's what we can do. We can move him here. Um, she can't get a shot off, but she can do mind fray when she gets close enough. So really, it, it's up to just a, a really awesome flank right now. And just totally wrecking him. It's 83. Come on. Ha! Oh, we did it. Operational objectives completed. Whew, well, everyone lived and that was very difficult. Oh man, not a fucking mission I wanted to have today, I believe me. But, you know, we did it, we came back, everyone lived. Considering how everyone's very experienced, the only problem is, the, the one thing I think that screwed me is, like, maybe like two mistakes. Oh, now I'm a Psy Operative. And that means I can now actually do the final mission, but I want to level someone up, because as if you haven't noticed, that like that was a difficult mission in the last one, and I almost died. Because, you know, people weren't doing what they were supposed to necessarily, so. It was, yeah, mind control and telekinetic field. So we can create an immobile telekinetic field, uh, which grants 40 defense and, and uh, I don't know how long it lasts for. Lasts through the enemy turn. I have never actually used this. I don't know how it looks or how it works, uh, but we're getting mind control because uh, we get to mind control shit. I mean, come on, mind control, guys. But, uh, he also got a promotion in the meantime, and, uh, as I said, opportunist, very good ability. Wow, everyone's wounded today. Another live capture? Please give my thanks to the main commander. I know it can't be an easy task trying to bring them in alive. You can trust that the research team will make it worth the trouble. Okay, and... We got a heavy plasma out of it, some grenades, and a bunch of corpses, and Illyrium, alien alloys, and a whole bunch of shit. Nice. Okay. Well then, uh, what do we have? We have some research we can do, so we might as well just start that. Interrogate the Mutant Elite. Let's do that. Uh, all, te all technology, uh, whatever. Oh, well, he's not happy, but we got some weapons, technology, research credit. And we also got a achievement for uh, getting all the research, which is apparently something I didn't, didn't do my last run, so. Alright, um, nothing else for me really to do here but to uh, scan for activity. And all this stuff is now finishing. Should, can, I, can I do any more uh, foundry projects? Yeah, advanced destruction, let's do it. Why not? We're certainly keeping the boys down in the foundry busy. Oh. Yeah, I don't care. Okay. Mkudo is gifted. Not something I would have ever thought. <laughs> and he's a support, so I guess he's my support now. Okay. Sergeant Mkudo looking to replace Mr. Shiv. Right. Transfer complete. And we got another heavy weapons platform stuff. Alright, and what do we... I d think I just... Uh, what did I transfer? Oh, I think... One of these things. Oh yeah, I, I was moving around demon ships and stuff. Firestorms, whatever they are. Alright. And we got the advanced repair project. And the rest of the side testing is about to go down. Aliens are now terrorizing Hamburg! It's the it's the uh, the city of Hamburger. But uh we have Who's st who's still fucking sick? 
Well then, we have the best team of the squaddies up for the task. This is gonna be fun. Well, you know, uh, yeah, I'll resort this for next time. So until then, just like the NSA, we will be watching. <laughs>